This is the Sunday Business Page with John Delano. Good morning, I'm John Delano. Welcome to another home edition of the Sunday Business Page. And our special guest today is Jim Futrell, who is Vice President of Market Research at the Allegheny Conference. The Allegheny Conference just this last Friday came out with new figures on unemployment. Jim, welcome to the show. It's good to have you here. Thanks, John. Good morning. So let me ask you first, what exactly is the Allegheny Conference? The uh, Allegheny Conference is a private nonprofit organization supported uh, by Pittsburgh's corporate and foundation community that uh, works to improve the economy of the region uh, through three affiliates, the uh, Greater Pittsburgh Chamber of Commerce, which works to uh, advocate for improvements in the business climate, the Pittsburgh Regional Alliance, which works to recruit businesses to the region and assist expanding businesses in the region, and the Pennsylvania Economy League of Greater Pittsburgh, which uh, is conducts public, uh, research and analysis on uh, relevant issues in the area. And that, of course, uh, is part of what you're up to, I guess, uh, reporting and studying the economic and unemployment figures in our region. And, and if I read this study that you just released on Friday, there's some good news for our region, yes? Yep. Tell and, us about it. Well, um, yeah, we, we continue to see an improvement in the economy. You know, between uh, February and April, the region lost over 200,000 jobs. You know, as we saw in much of the country, it was a very severe and sudden economic drop. And we have been slowly coming back from that. Uh, as of now, we've recovered about 70% of the, jo the jobs that were lost in that February to April period. And uh, we've seen a steady drop in the unemployment rate. It's now 6.1%, uh, which is slightly lower than the national average, uh, which is uh, encouraging, but you, know, you have to uh, take that in context. What we have seen, not only has, have jobs rebounded and the amount of people filing unemployment claims dropped, but the labor force has shrunk, which means you're seeing discouraged workers that are dropping out of the labor force. Um, so that's bringing down the rate a little bit too. Yeah, you know, that's got to be a real problem when people are so discouraged from finding work that they're not out looking. And that means that it really affects the figures. Um, let me ask you this question, Jim. Uh, there's some regional variations depending on what county you live in. Is that, you've discovered that as well? Yeah, that's correct. Um, we, we um, for the first time, we're able to get some uh, government employment data that showed employment trends through June for each county in the region by industry. And uh, it was interesting to see the different personalities each one had. So while well, the leisure and hospitality sector accounts for the bulk of the job losses in the 10 county region, that was much more of an impact in the, uh, the jobs lost in, in uh, the February to June period in Allegheny County. Over 40% of the jobs lost in Allegheny County are in leisure and hospitality. Uh, conversely, uh, if you look at a county like Beaver County, uh, where you have you know, roughly 6,000 construction workers at the Shell Cracker plant. As you might recall, they had to temporarily halt production there for a few months. And as a result, you saw the construction really accounted for the bulk of the job losses in Beaver County. Green County, which is a very uh, important energy hub, uh, the natural resources and mining were the greatest contributor. Whereas other counties like Armstrong and Westmoreland trade, transportation, and utilities, so retail jobs, distribution jobs, those were all, um, you know, drove the uh, decrease in those counties. We only have about 20 seconds left. Are you optimistic for the future? Well, I th I, I'm always optimistic. What we've really seen, you've seen reports of a K-shaped um, recovery, and I think that's really uh, obvious now. You see most of the industries are within um, 5 to 10 percent of the employment levels they had in February whereas leisure and hospitality continues to struggle. It's uh, running about 30% less than uh, where it was in February. Well, Jim Frutel, who is the Vice President of Market Research for the Allegheny Conference, thank you, sir, very much for being with us today. We really appreciate it. Thanks, John. Good talking with you. And thank you for watching us on this edition of the Sunday Business Page. Please stick with us. We'll see you next week.